It's been said that overnight success is the result of years of hard work. And for international paper, becoming the world's largest producer of packing materials began 125 years ago. And while you might not think words like sustainable or renewable apply to a paper mill, you'd be wrong. Well, making corrugated packaging is a very interesting process. You know, we take fiber from the forests, uh, bring it into the mill by either in long wood form or chip form. We'll chip up that material, we'll cook it in a digester, and then we'll take that pulp and lay it on a machine and make the paper that way. It's, it's a very fascinating process. We also make all our own steam, our own electricity, so it's a pretty self-contained operation. The other thing that's beautiful about it is we use the residuals to produce the fuel. So the bark from the tree and the cooking residuals are what we use to cook in our boilers to make the steam, to make the electricity. So it's a very cyclical, uh, renewable process. The story of international paper in our area began in 1999 when they acquired the now 85-year-old paper mill on the Savannah River. And as they have grown and improved operations, our community has been a perfect fit. I've got good workforce. We've got access to uh, the fiber in Georgia. It's a very fiber-rich area. We've got access to water. And right now, with uh, International Paper, we're right next door to the Georgia Ports. So we partner with them, and over 50% of what we produce goes to the Georgia Ports, gets on a steamship, and goes around the world. So that's a real strategic advantage for us here at the Savannah Mill, to have the ports next door, and then be a partner with us to help deliver our product around the world. It's interesting uh, that the Georgia Ports is the number one export port in, in the United States now. So we're num the number three gateway overall, and, uh, but we are the number one export port. So IP has been a big, big part of, uh, a, a big part of that success for the Georgia Ports. What, the, what we like and what the ocean carriers really like with IP is the consistency of their volumes. They're not subject to the seasonality that a lot of the retailers on the import side are. So for, for IP, for international paper, those volumes are just very steady, very consistent. That has a lot of value for the Georgia ports and for their ocean carrier partners and everyone in the supply chain that, uh, that, 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 that works with international paper. Over 1,000 employees in our area, tens of millions of dollars per year in payroll, and hundreds of millions of dollars per year in local wood and fiber purchases. That alone would be a huge benefit to our community. But International Paper is determined to go further through their work with local nonprofits and to give back to a region that has been so good to them. Well, we see ourselves as a great partner with the community. Uh, we live and work here, so we want to be a, a good partner with the community. We're, we're cognizant of our responsibility as a big industry in a, in, a, in a beautiful resort town that we get to live in. So we, we partner with our community, whether through volunteerism, through financial help, or uh, you know, just try to be there when, when the need comes through. How can you really tell that somewhere is a great place to work? The tenure of a company's employees speaks volumes. And at International Paper, it seems no one wants to leave. So yeah, our most tenured employee, we're very proud of, has been here 57 years at the International Papers of Adam Mill. So we're very proud of him, and he says he's got another 50 in him. So we'll see how, how he does. But it's very common to come across employees with 40 years, or their father worked here, or their mother worked here, or their grandfather worked here. So our employees are very proud of the organization, and they tend to stay with us. And uh, it's a great, great to see somebody who's, who has family roots in the same organization. So we're very, very proud of that. For their contributions and dedication to our community, International Paper is our 2023 World Trade Center Savannah International Business of the Year.